sad truth about fat now how you gonna get mad at a nigga calling you fat if you are fat right how you even gonna get mad at that nigga that's what you are you don't make no sense and then secondly another thing about this this it's and people in this generation they be trying to make new words for fat like just say fat like the frick is fat phobic we'll get into that later what the frick like come on my nigga like actually come on but anyway there's a sad horrible truth sad horrible everything about fat people niggas will be on your beat about calling niggas fat and then when you go tell a nigga that they fat if they are fat they get offended like i already said this but how you gonna get offended at somebody calling you what you are like bro that's like me going to go to ramsey ramsey and tell him he's a good cook it's because he is a good cook you're fat and i'm telling you that you're fat what's the difference what's positive one's negative okay it's the same thing like get off get off my meat but anyway and then no nah, nah, nah. and then there's like this 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 stupid double standard if I say one thing about a female getting fat being fat or something nigga they gonna send an entire mafia to come to my house they're gonna pull my IP come bust my door down while I'm sleeping put a machete to my throat and threaten me with a gun and a machete until I tell them why I said they were fat but a female can go up to a fat nigga and be like, hey, you're fat. And he's just, he's just supposed to accept it. Like, the double standards are wild, too. So that's why I don't really like this generation, either. Because they be doing the most wildest stuff. It don't make no sense, cuz. Like, literally, don't make any sense. And then on top of that, cuz. On top of that, niggas be like, shoot, I don't even know, cuz. I don't even know. The fat stuff be getting so, it be getting crazy, bro. Like, I swear it be getting crazy. It don't make any sense. Uh oh, yes, this is a pair of headphones. This is a microphone. Get off my meat. I don't have a handheld, I don't got a mic. It's what I gotta use. Get off my meat. I'm black and I'm poor. You dig? But anyways, now. Yeah. Let's be 100% honest. If you a fat nigga in 2023, with all these different types of stereotypes and all types of stuff going on right now, Gen Z, all this stuff, people making up stuff, being trans, all this type of stuff, everything, making up new words and all type. If you're fat in this generation and with all the, and how people are in this world and like the double standards and everything, Let's keep it up. I'm gonna keep it a buck 50 with you. You probably are going to die alone. Like, <laughs> like you're, if you're not funny as frick or you just have a good personality, you got a good fuck. But, um, yeah. Yeah, basically. Like, if you're gonna make fun of one group of fat people, why not make fun of the other? Wait, why not make fun of the other? And if. And then for guys, if it's like if you don't lose weight, you're just gonna be a fat freak who lives in society and who's probably gonna die alone. Like it, it doesn't make any sense. But then if a nigga like me goes and says something like that to freaking Lizzo or some other mainstream person who's big, fat, and the whole town would be on me. It'd be niggas would be having rituals to the devil trying to get me killed. Like, bro, come on, get out your feelings. <laughs> I swear, like, that is a big problem. No, no pun intended, but yeah. Hey, hey, I got merch now. You already know that. This is just a plug. Hey, what we got all this is not my merch. This is not my merch. I'm not wearing my merch, but I do have merch. But uh, we got all types of we got all types of designs. The name of the the name of the brand is called Chan. Yurt. Uh, I I don't know. I might do a sale or something. I don't even know. But the the stuff is fire. So go cop for sure. But uh, without further ado, let's get back to the video. Ah. In this day and age, in this society, if you're not in shape, 
you're, like I already said this, you're gonna die alone. Like if a, if a fat person even dared to go walk up to a skinny girl in this generation, I'm tell what's gonna happen. They would look at you, they would laugh, and then walk away. And that's the sad truth about it. Like fat men really don't have a chance in this world, but it's the entire opposite for women. Women may be like, hey, you're so beautiful, girl. Keep on eating. Keep on doing this. Keep on doing that. Like, nigga. Be for real. But that was the main part. That was the main point of this whole video. The horrible truth about being fat in Gen Z. It's, it's a whole lot of stuff that I didn't say in this video that I could have said. But this video going to get too long. It's going to take too long for me to edit. And I don't feel like doing all that. So, if you like this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Subscribe to the channel. Wait, what? Hit that subscribe button, like the video, comment what you want to see next. Uh, go buy my merch, and uh, until next time, my brothers. My, what? Until next time, my brothers and sisters. I'm, I'm not copying Corey, but yeah, I'll see you later. Ah.